Well, it's getting crazy in Lakerland. Yeah, L.A. Lakerland. I know, I'm in Chicago. But uh, you know what the Bulls are going through is nothing. First, D'Angelo Russell with the tape uh, that he made of Nick Young. And now people are trying to state a case for him. Well, did he leak it out? Well, who shot it? Who's the cameraman? Who's doing the narrative? And everybody is, not everybody, but a lot of people are trying to state a case. Well, he's a young, he's immature. You're 20 years old making big man dollars. And you can't snitch. You learned that in the neighborhood from the time you're eight, nine years old. You don't snitch. However it got out, we know where it started. Also, Lamar Odom, I hear the L.A. press buying into Lamar Odom. He's got a long way to go. Yeah, I'd say so. He almost died in a brothel. But on top of that, uh, Easter Sunday morning before Mass, always good to down three or four Remy Martins. And then the most uncomfortable part of the night last night was Kobe Bryant being questioned about D'Angelo Russell's indiscretions. Seems to me he was Kobe Bryant. So maybe people were more understanding, even in a tough situation. If D'Angelo Russell isn't Kobe Bryant, I don't see every, any evidence of that. He's going to be good. He's got a long way to go, ladies and gentlemen. But the whole L.A. thing, it finally caught up to him. They had 30, 40 years of a good run. But I guess when you're going to have a bad run, it doesn't get much worse than this. Mike North, the Daily Herald, the Rebel Inside.